In this video, I'm going to show you how to load data from a file that's not in a folder that's not in your current working directory where your code is located. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to get the file path to the working directory. So I'm going to define a variable called file path. And if you know the name of that, you can type the name in there. But if you don't know the name of your working directory, uh, you can go to your finder window and navigate to where your deck, your info, your file folders are stored. So I'm going to go in here to sample data and I have preferred walking one dot mat right here. And I'm going to just drag that into the command window and it will load that in. And then I can see here that part of that is my file string. So I'm going to go ahead and copy that part. And I'm going to paste it up here inside of single quotes. So I want the single quotes because that tells MATLAB that it's a string. MATLAB's expecting a string for the file path. Then I can go ahead and if I want, I can replicate what I just did with a file name and take preferred walking one dot mat. And then I can use, do something like whole file is equal to, I'm going to use the command string cat, which concatenates strings. So I'm going to do file path, comma, file name. And if you don't know what a command does, so you can always go up to home and the help and click on the help button and it will open the help window. And inside the help window, you can then search for the command. And it will tell you what function it is. And you can see examples and read about how to use it and concatenate strings horizontally. All right, so it gives you this kind of thing. So uh, the help window is a great tool. You can also search if you don't know the name of the command, but you have an idea, you can try searching that. Uh, though it can be more useful to search the MATLAB help forms on Google to get that done. So now, back here in the code, I could do load whole file. And if I save and run, so I'm going to go back to my editor tab here. I'm going to save and I'm going to run. And I run loop demo. It closes everything. It clears everything. And now we've got whole file, which is loaded in preferred walking one. 